MetaTrader 5 came with this new update on Android devices that looks totally different from the previous app version. On this video, I will show you all the awesome changes made and how to use them efficiently and effectively in your trading. First change. On this new version of MT5, we have now this blue band in the top of the screen unlike on the previous version of it. Second change. On the previous version, we had this F symbol on the top that we used when we wanted to add indicators, but on this new MetaTrader app version, it has changed to this symbol beside the press icon. So from now onwards, if you want to add indicators to your screen, you will have to click on this symbol. Third change, the previous version of MT5, we had the dollar sign that we used as a shortcut when we wanted to change in between different markets. But on this new version, it has been removed. What happened here is that it has been combined with this new order tool to form a new combined symbol. So if you click on this tool and press on the market, it will now give you an option to choose any markets that are in your code shop that you want to shift to. The new order tool on the previous version, it was used as a shortcut when we wanted to go and press our orders. But now it can be just done with this same tool. On this middle box right here is where you type the lot says you will want to use on the trade you are about to trade. And once you're done, just click either buy or sell and you will be done. To make it disappear, just press it on it again and it will disappear. Force change. On this new version, we can change the time frames by clicking on this tool unlike on the previous MT5 version we did not have it here before. Before I go to the most of all cool feature that has been added this month on MetaTrader 5, please take this time to like this video, subscribe to this channel and don't forget to turn the notification bell icon on. Now this new cool feature made me so happy. Before when I wanted to go and press buy limit or sell limit orders, I had to either memorize numbers or copy it in the notebook before I go and press the orders. But right now, it is normal, as I can just click on this new tool here and tap anywhere I want my orders to be pressed. If it is below the price, it will automatically be buy limit. If you go above the current market price, it will change straight to sell limit. Right here, you can press either stop loss or take profit, whatever you want. Once pressed, these horizontal lines will appear and you can modify them by pressing anywhere on the screen. Once done, you will click on this arrow and you will see all the details are automatically filled for you. Guys and girls, with this new update, you don't have to memorize the numbers no more. So that's it for today, guys and girls. If you like this video, please do not forget to subscribe and turn the notification bell icon on for more forex related videos. Happy trading!